Greetings from Du Bois, Wyoming. We've been spending a few days with a good friend of ours, Dave, another Dave. Uh, we haven't seen him in, gosh, probably eight, over eight years, I think, or close to eight years. And so our travels took us by his place in Du Bois. So I'll let you check out the views. Dave's on a run this morning, but I just wanted to show you our views we've had the last few days. Really incredible. There's been so much wildlife around here. Um, we've seen antelope, we've seen deer. Uh, the Daves went on a run yesterday morning and they saw a fox. So there's just a ton of wildlife. Here's our view out this window. There's some antelope out there this morning. Uh, today we will be taking off though, and we'll be heading through the Tetons and also Yellowstone. Now, I don't know how far we're going to make it into which one, you know, uh, we have no plans for tonight, so we don't know where we're going to spend the night. Uh, but it's definitely going to be some scenic driving and, uh, we'll just figure it out when we get there. Do not approach bears from your vehicle. <laughs> Noted. Sad they have to have that disclaimer up. Um, so I don't know if you can tell right now, but there is a lot of smoke from some forest fires. I think the Canadian forest fires, the wind is pushing smoke down here. So we'll see what kind of views we get. Uh, yeah, heading into the Tetons. And I'll, I don't think we'll make it into Yellowstone today, but you never know. You never know. We're just out for a drive. Just went over the Continental Divide. Now, just about a year ago, we were bicycling over the Continental Divide. <laughs> On the East Coast. Uh -huh. Lots of snow, man. This is cool. So majestic. Look at that. It's just stunning. Dave's checking out our first camping option. We can definitely get through this, but there's a sign that says no camping. So he's gonna read the fine print on that maybe and see if the campground's closed or what it's trying to tell us. I have noticed a lot of the roads, um, the side roads have gates that are closed. So not a lot is open quite yet. the thumbs up looks like we're good to go it'll be empty because people don't want to drive through this water <laughs> just means no camping right here it says um, camping in motor vehicles only in designated spots okay so we'll see if it's open up here further but i just gotta drive through the water anyway yeah it's just a half mile it says We have a creek crossing up ahead. I see it. It's um, it's wild and yeah, we're definitely uh, taking this somewhere. I wouldn't take the van. That's for sure. What do you think? You think? Yeah, I just gotta keep the left 
tire. Oh. But listen, um, that's not very wide. Quite enough. You're good on this side. You just go straight. wanted to see what was a hundred percent do not like that well, do, that's why we got this I know but <laughs> oh that was freaking awesome I didn't grow up doing these types of things so I don't know what this is capable of like I don't I'm not so I'll just have to get comfortable with utilizing this vehicle how it can be used I just that freaked me out okay that really freaked me out I swore we were just gonna go down the river and you would never hear from us again <laughs> oh the wilderness trails we'll have to have bear spray out anytime we're outside oh yeah be bear aware out. food storage required so yeah we probably won't be cooking a lot outside and this one looks good right out in the open yeah oh it's not even a pay Well, the pay station and the sign, pay station and sign are down, so I'm gonna say this is a free spot for the night. And there is not another soul here. <laughs> Beautiful. Because no one's silly enough to do that river crossing. <laughs> <laughs> At least we met a truck camper coming out that had just crossed. <clears throat> if we had not, I. Would... Does this look good to you, Ben? We can walk around and find something better, but this is a nice spot. It's open for Starlink. It's open for Starlink. It's clean, nice table. We've got a bear store. Oh, there's even a ball for a pistol out there. It's meant to be. Lord, okay, I have to decompress a little bit. <laughs> that was exciting. <laughs> snack plate time. We got some sardines, Kipper snacks. She just had lunch and some freeze dried salmon. She's good to go. Got some wine and a red solo cup. And a beautiful view. I walked around a little bit. It's a pretty big campground and there's no one here. I don't know why. Yeah, I wonder why. I think the river crossing, I felt like I was um, playing the video game Oregon Trail that I grew up with. It's like we're having to ford the river in the wagon. <laughs> well, with the, the water was only maybe eight inches deep on the right side. Yeah. And you're driving on concrete rough concrete and we weigh like a lot <laughs> 12,000 pounds so I don't that, know. that water was not going to wash us away so. no yeah but you but know, it's intimidating so, mm -hmm. if you've not done stuff like that before and I can see everyone turning around yeah I mean obviously the van would not have survived no <laughs> we would have been underwater no no, no. our underhood generator would have been soaked flooded yeah so we're already utilizing our clearance. I'd say it's been a win so far. That was awesome. <laughs> Did I mention that? <sighs> Everyone's got a full valley. We're doing a walk about here. So this is Sheffield Campground in the National Teton. Teton, was it Grand Teton National Forest? Is that? Grand Teton National Park. National Park. <laughs> That's a mouthful. Um, yeah, now as you can see the footage coming in, the smoke really kind of has put the, put a haze over the whole view of mountains and it's still stunning though um, but I wish that was a little bit clearer um, yeah we are the only ones in this campground and there's a lot of notice for bear activity now the whole way in our whole drive today we saw zero wildlife which I am shocked by I think you saw a roadkill deer right at Du Bois but nothing inside the parks at all yet 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 we'll uh see if they smell the uh, good food inside the camper tonight oh like the sardines we opened and the kippered snacks you hear the camper start rocking tonight 
<laughs> what do we do? We can't, yeah, it's not like the van. We can't just climb forward and drive away, right? Hooey bay. Yeah. Pretty desolate here. Just beautiful. There's a little creek over here. Oh, they have an outhouse. That's nice. Don't go to these places without your counter assault bear yeah, spray. Yeah, we're prepared. Man, I can't believe this is empty. <laughs> oh, no. Like, oh no! Oh no! <laughs> Good morning. We're getting ready to go back over the river. We're going to ford the river this and morning. through the woods? <laughs> yeah. We're going to continue on through the Tetons and up in the Yellowstone today. We'll see how far we make it. Uh, might end up going all the way through. I don't know. But um, one thing I wanted to show you before we head out is this snap camera mount. Uh, I've had this for a while and I haven't, I haven't really used it. Maybe once or twice. But... Um, I wanted to show you what it does and what I'm going to do is try and put this um, on the bumper of the truck so I could see kind of how deep that water is as we go over. So it comes with different um, mounting scenarios. Now what we're going to, um, it even has a, a lanyard so you could strap it around your neck and um, it's got magnetized pieces. So one piece snaps into the next. Um, but today I'm just going to be mounting my camera on this and then we're going to put this on our chrome bumper to protect it a little bit. And then we're just going to snap that on. It's super magnetic. Very, very <laughs> strong. Um, where'd we get it? I think I got it on Amazon. Yeah. I've had it a while. I'll put a link below if you guys are interested, but I'm going to attach the camera and then we're going to put it on the bumper somewhere. Okay, so that'll mount on the bumper. Yeah. Okay. Let's do it. Okay, where are we gonna put it? I'm not gonna worry about this. Okay. Yeah, I think that'll be that, good. Just kind of right in front. Oh, let's not forget to turn it on. Because this is all too <laughs> curved, the magnet won't stick on there. Oh yeah, okay. Oh, so. well, let's give it a shot. Turning it on. We'll see what we get. <laughs> we'll have a camera when we get back. Okay, it's running. Oh, the river hasn't risen. Oh my gosh, yeah. So it started sprinkling yesterday, and I was like, do we need to get out of here because the river's going to get higher? <laughs> oh, dramatic. Stop. <laughs> I gotta get out and scout it too. Oh yeah, for sure. <clears throat> it does look higher. <laughs> Yahoo! We made it! Good driving, babe. Easy piece of cake. Piece of cake, he says. <laughs> that was so awesome to get back in there and have that beautiful campground to ourselves for two days. Oh, amazing. Yeah. I didn't do any running. Not in bear country. <laughs> no serious bear country here. We yeah. don't have bells. We had spray though. We had that readily available at our site at all times. <laughs> all right let's see what we're gonna find out today um or find today i would like to see some wildlife uh we'll see what happens catch you down the road carry on carry on thanks for watching and a very special thank you to our patrons for supporting our channel join us over on patreon for extra videos and more content 
check out our website or Amazon for our pistol book. Carry on. Carry on.